All right guys, welcome back. Today we are back working on the Supra. I know you guys have seen a little bit of the GR Corolla content, but we are not straying too much away from the Supra. We are actually doing a mod on the compressor housing to actually create that whistle effect. Um, you guys have probably heard about it a little bit. Uh, we're gonna have a link below on our website, but let me show you what we're actually doing to the housing itself. So this is the compressor housing that we actually pulled off our car. And we're gonna, I'm gonna show you the new one. So this is sent out, we work with one of our suppliers. I'll have his information below and it'll be available on our website. So as you can see, the, the difference on the unit is very minimal from the backside, a little bit more beveling, but on the front, you got some extra little pieces there which lets airflow throw, flow through. So can you guys see that right there? That's the line where this insert is actually pressed in. A full, like this is kind of considered a T51R mod, and that's what it's kind of being called. A full T51R mod will come actually all the way out. And then you'd have to actually modify this piece. You'd have to get it from Pure or something like that. But this thing works really well. It's, it's not gonna bring any power or anything like that. It's just gonna add that extra sound and that really nice cool turbo whistle. As we wrapped up switching out the turbo compressor housing on this, as you can see, we've reinstalled the carbon cover from MV Specialties. We got the HKS bar back on. You can barely tell this is on. So this car has a stock air box with this carbon fiber cover. We have the HKS blow valve on this car. So let's take it for a ride and let's see what kind of sounds this generates. And we can actually turn off the HKS blow valve. If you guys remember the video that we did, how you can actually dial it in. I'll bring a small screwdriver with me and we can uh, actually just get the pure sounds of just this compressor housing with a stock air intake box. So let's go for a spin. Actually, while this car was up on the lift, we decided to install the engine SES exhaust. So that's what you're seeing here. So you're actually gonna hear this for the first time as well too. So let's get a cold start on this. lock this car you're gonna hear the blow off valve open up so let's go for a little rip and then we can actually turn this thing completely off so we can hear the turbo compressor let's go All right guys, so we'll have this up on our website. It's a pretty cool little mod. It's not gonna make any power or anything like that, but just gives you a really different sound. Um, one other thing we did on another car that we've already installed this on is we actually opened up the plastic insert that goes, uh, the turbo inlet hose. We opened that up a little bit to allow some more airflow and it really just screams a lot more. So you can really get this thing to open up a lot, lot more. So we've been really busy with the GR Corolla. So hopefully you guys have enjoying some of those clips. So I'm kind of bouncing my time back and forth between both these cars. And uh, hopefully you guys really like this install plus the engine exhaust. And uh, stay tuned for the next video. Thanks guys.